Okay, so let's get right into it. Uh, it is currently 3.33 a.m. Uh, I just came back from Walmart and got the new iPad. Uh, took a hell of a lot of time, but this is an unboxing, so let's get it started. Remember, for the latest news, check out iPhoneArt.com or download Nerd Center from the App Store. So this is the box. Looks pretty much the same. Exactly the same as the iPad 2 box, and it's exactly the same dimensions, exactly the same serial numbers. Pretty much everything is the same. So let's get to the actual unboxing. I'm gonna grab a knife here. I'm in my I said it's very, 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 very early in the morning. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just crack a hole here. Put that down. And we're gonna open this up and just rip this plastic off. Okay. Alright. So let's see what's in the box. Which I'm pretty sure many of you probably already know what's in the box. Alright, so let's get this done. I'm gonna pop this open. I need to bring my, my tripods in the car, so I didn't get to bring it. Alright, so we have the usual corporate, which is the iPad itself. It's right on the top. They added a nice tab over here, which is practically on all models. And this is the iPad itself. We're going to set that up in a second, and we're going to go ahead and turn it on right in a second. Just give it a test run. So I'm going to put that right inside this box here. And we have the usual accessories that come with an iPad, which is your charging block, right? The same uh, MagSafe charging block. You have your USB cord, which is very, very standard. And you also have the manuals and maybe some Apple logos. Apple did start getting stingy with these logos, so let's see what happens. Uh, oh, you have a neat little little uh, menu here. It lets you understand where the buttons are, which is pretty easy if you've ever had an iDevice before. And you have a manual, which nobody ever reads. And you also have the Apple stickers, so you can stick places. People normally stick them in the back of their cars. It's very corny, but... You know, people do corny stuff. So now that that's that, that's there. Let's put that over to the side. Let's get into the actual iPad here. All right, let's push that up. And let's see if it's on. Okay, it's not on. We're going to have to turn it on. So let me turn it on here. We've got the Apple logo. Leaving the plastic on here. There's definitely a plastic over this covering it if you see it so it might not be as sharp and retina as you might expect it to be so let's see what the boot time is compared to what the iPad 2 was my iPad 2 is still lingering around here but since it's 3 o'clock in the morning I am not going to look for it okay so we've got the setup screen should be pretty easy same things as before. We're going to go ahead and say that we're not in China and that we are in the United States of America. Okay, enable location services, yes. It'd be nice to see when they actually come out with a jailbreak for this. Connecting to the Wi-Fi network now. And that's actually pretty neat. It actually came with 96%. I don't know if you can see it there. But there's 96% battery actually. So it came pretty charged up right out of the box. So now we're joining the network. We're just waiting for that to load. Okay, so we're we have joined the network. Now it says we're activating the iPad. Uh, set up as new iPad, yes, we're gonna set it up as a new iPad. And now I have to sign in with my Apple ID. Okay, so so we have signed in with the Apple ID. Now we're going to agree to the terms, which is the usual setup. Just setting it up for you guys to see this real hands-on demonstration of the new iPad. Remember that you can go to iPhoneNerd.com, 
to get the latest news and reviews on everything there will also be a written review with snapshots photos much 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 de more detailed than this right on the website iphonenerd.com if you're also jailbroken go ahead and add the repo cydia.iphonenerd.com to your sources and you'll get a load of nice apps another way to stay connected with us would be to subscribe to this video rate it and like it and you can download the nerd center app straight from the app store it is available there just go ahead and search nerd center pop it into your phone and or your ipad and you will be in a very good situation uh, a new thing here that's come up is dictation which is basically apple announced that now we can type with our voice right on the ipad so it's asking me whether i want to use this or not and i have a, a, uh, chosen to use this tech dictation and I'm gonna go ahead and click next. I do not want to send diagnostics to Apple. And yes, I do want to register with Apple. Okay, now let's start using the iPad. So hands on here, I mean, you could see it on the screen. It is very sharp. I mean, to me here personally, it looks sharp. It does not, however, look so much more amazingly sharp. Much, much more sharper than the uh, than the actual iPad 2. I think that this is not a deal breaker for most people. We will have to see in a more in-depth tutorial, in a more in-depth uh, video, how good the actual graphics are when you play games. Uh, otherwise, it seems to work pretty normal. Um, and once again, if you guys like the video, please comment, rate, and subscribe. And go ahead and head over to iPhoneNerd.com and download Nerd Center from the Apple App Store. This has been an unboxing, and you guys have a very, very great.